Hi Aquarius, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. We're gonna do your April read. Let's see the messages for you. This is going to be a bonus reading for you guys. Since this is a general reading, so take what resonates and leave what doesn't resonate. For more personals and accuracy, reach out on WhatsApp, Instagram, and email. Details are given down below. Also, to my previous version, we have crystals of all kinds, and that I curate with healing energies of love and I charge them as well, fully charged, intention-based crystals. Subscribe to this channel for more videos on your sign. <clears throat> Do like, share, comment in the end. Now let's see what are the messages for you. What are the messages for you, Aquarius? What are the messages for you? <clears throat> okay. We have the seven of wands, the king of wands, the ace of wands, the eight of swords, <clears throat> and the knight of cups. Someone is trying too hard to get back with you. But you're like, you blocked this person and moved away. I feel there was a relationship in the past with this person, some sort of a situation. You really wanted them. But they were never wanting to commit here. But I feel like this person has been trying so hard to get back to you. Maybe they've realized their feelings or there's so much of attraction that desire to have you in their life. Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy. This person is highly interested in you. Yeah, that's what I'm getting here. I feel like you want to block this or you've just blocked this person and moved on from them. Maybe they didn't want love here. Yes, I feel like the reason is because you felt like this person is playing you around. Because whenever there was a talk of commitment or something serious, they backed away. And whenever you were not talking to them, they kept coming back to you. So I feel like you... <clears throat> are on a different stage in your life where you want love, where you want, you know, emotional connection. But this person's still wanting something that's like base level. Okay. Um, we have the magician. We have the page of pericles. We have the oh page of cups, and then we have one more please, nine of cups. This person has been pretty on and off with you, Aquarius. They were playing you around. They were on and off. And you had a lot of love and expectation from this person. At least there were like initial stages of like love and falling in love and crush. You were crushing over this person. You, you saw them as your dream come true. <clears throat> they always told you that they're busy with work. But this is because they were not that interested. They were not like wanting to commit with you but they were definitely interested in something like more casual so you felt like this person is playing you around so you decided to walk away it, it took you six months it took you a long time to completely get over this i feel like right now you're just not interested you're just not you bored of it bored of the drama and you're releasing this <clears throat> right now you have this thing in your heart somewhere that you could go back and fix things but you know that there's it's not easy to change a person so you're also not able to find anyone new that's attractive you're not able to attract someone not able like I feel like you're not getting someone that actually makes your heart go you know like crazy <clears throat> So you're in this energy of not wanting to be alone, getting committed, but not finding the one that actually touches your heart and you don't want to go back. So you're in this energy of being like in two, two things, like two things are running in your mind. You're not feeling stable right now. You're thinking a lot about what happened in the past. Somewhere you're feeling stuck because of this person's act, you know, act and, uh, and that there's no one new around. So this kind of makes you feel like uh, not very excited, okay? So Aquarius, I feel there is someone. I feel like you have this deep inside of you still wanting to, you know, give them a chance. 
Okay, let me see. Okay. <clears throat> I feel like you're stuck, Aquarius. You're stuck. You really want to fix things with them, but you're stuck. Like, I feel. I'm also seeing that you want to shout at this person, tell them what exactly wasn't right from their part, but they will act like nothing happened, and that is going to stress you more. The Five of Cups energy is more about. not feeling at peace <clears throat> deep down you're missing this person deep down you don't want to reconnect but you're definitely missing this person and sometimes you do go into that phase of moodiness not wanting to pay attention I'm definitely seeing that there's someone that is obsessed with your body more than emotion. Yes, that's the thing. I feel like this person is more interested in getting down with you, but they're not very interested in opening up their heart and that hurts you, that bothers you. <clears throat> they are also acting shady because there is someone else in their life. Definitely. And they're not in love with anyone. This is why you have made a decision to stay alone and away from this person. The good news over here is that you have new option in love coming in. Someone completely new, really fast. Could be a cancer that's coming in, but really fast. You have this person rushing towards you with a love offer. Definitely. But you're suspecting of this person. You're suspicious that they only want the same thing like how the past was. The Two of Cups, I'm definitely seeing that this is a potential match. The one that's coming towards you with a lot of passion and desire. Initially, you might resist this because you might compare them with this person. I feel like, yes, there's a relationship you guys will be forming with each other. Yeah, I'm seeing a, you know, Two of Cups and the Four of Pentacles is like you guys binding yourself with each other. and. <clears throat> Intense connection is what I can say, like emotional, deep. This connection has the highest potential of getting materialized. You won't believe, I feel like you're not that interested in them or you won't be much interested. You, you will be taking it slow, okay? You won't give too much of your time and attention to this, but this person is falling in love with you. Yeah, okay. You will be on and off a little like not very interested, but this person was definitely very interested. That's coming. Could be a soulmate of yours. You guys, this is the one. I feel this is your soulmate. The lovers and the judgment. This is your soulmate and you guys may have to make a decision on marrying with them. They might offer you marriage here. I feel after a long time you'll realize that this is the one for you because their consistency is so strong and they're talking about soulmates, they're talking about marriage, they're talking about future kids and they're so fixated on you. <clears throat> but I feel like the past just doesn't leave you. It just keeps coming back to you in your mind. You, you still think that might be there is a possibility of turning things around with the past person. Or you may expect a call or a message of this past person. But if you're done with it, I'm definitely seeing this past person is calling you and messaging you and telling you that they still want this. And that is the reason why you're, you're stuck between two things. Then we have the world. Then we have the hermit. <clears throat> Ten of wands. You're trying too hard. I feel like you're trying. You're not easy. You're not easy on yourself, Aquarius. Some of you, it's a father's... Uh, interference their father your father someone's father is interfering in this you want to start a new chapter in your life you want to let go of this but whenever you move on from this person you go back into deep thoughts and feeling of loneliness and that stresses you out <clears throat> Aquarius it's time to get back to your power because I feel like the one that you're going to end up with is 
is your lifelong partner and your father is someone that might be giving you a sound advice that you're not listening to or there's an older figure there's some sort of an interference caused by an older figure if it's not your father then it's their father not accepting you or there is an interference of an older figure in a bad manner and that is causing you stress maybe that's your boss if that is so you're leaving this place or work and you might go somewhere else within three weeks or three months time and over there you will see a lot of expansion here yeah six seven of swords <clears throat> Yeah, I feel like you're moving towards a change in your life. You might you, you might change your city, change your place for work. And I'm also seeing that you're running away from this love of your life that you you were stuck on. With that, your life will start moving forward fast. You have to make a decision because that way you will not get healed. So I feel like this is a time for healing. We have six and seven of... Uh, Miracles. Oh my gosh. You guys are still into this person. I feel like you're not able to get over them. Yeah. There's still strong attraction. And you guys still talk. Nine of Wands. <clears throat> there you go. There's some sort of a stressful situation at your work. Maybe you're paid well, but you're also doing a lot of work, which is stressing you out. Or you're looking for a breakthrough in your career, which you might get within few, like six or nine months, you will get a breakthrough in your career. There's a lot of success taking place, but the message for you is to stay really very strong in your own power. Do not let anyone decide your fate. Okay. Two of Wands. I feel like you are going to give this person a chance in love. This new person that is in your life. They're going to wait for you as long as you make them wait. You will be giving them a chance. And this person really loves you. I feel like they're in love with you or they will fall in love with you within two weeks or two months time. Leo energy. But I'm definitely saying you have to stay strong and you have to decide to pick yourself up and move forward in life. Okay. <clears throat> Trust. Playfulness. Romantic feelings. I feel you will start to trust this person. The new person that is around you really wants to win your heart. And I feel like you have, you're going through a lot of turmoils that you have gone through maybe in the past but now you will start to trust this person fully and start to feel emotionally connected with them you guys will have a lot of fun together definitely seeing there will be a lot of fun you will have with this new person release eventually in the month of april you're getting over your past but i think it will take a little more time for some of you who've already gotten over it your family is super happy because you started to lead yourself well and moving towards aligned goal. Aquarius, <clears throat> please. There you go. Transformation. So definitely you're going to be in a deep relationship where I'm definitely seeing you guys will marry each other. They have also gone through a lot and you have gone through a lot. Which is why they will understand your feelings and your heart much better. So the connection will get deepened between you two. Okay. Things will get deep. This person could be older, more mature of understanding things. They're waiting to come towards you with a proposal, I feel. You guys may meet this person while traveling, but I feel like they will make a proposal towards you. This is a kind of a person that you actually wanted to date. You will realize it after a few meetings. You're still waiting on someone from the past. You still have past feelings inside of you, like you're not fully over it. Yeah, you're finding it hard to let someone go out of your heart, you know. 
you're connected deeply with this person. You feel bad for being treated wrongly by them or, you know, maybe for some of you there, there was a strong physical connection and things just didn't flourish and that is why you miss this person. You haven't met this person yet. There's a deeper reason for each of your questions. Seek it. So you're like asking the universe, why did this didn't flourish for me? Why am I not ending up with this person? Why does this happen with me all the time? It's because the universe wants to greet you with something better in your life. <clears throat> Chaos and conflict. Some of you, number three, three. Something from the past may pop up in your life in April, which you might, you know, fight with this person or there will be some issues with this person. You guys will talk again and there will be fights, I feel. Okay, the past situation will come up and you will get to talk about things. If there was an unfinished business. I feel like you're a little stressed out, Aquarius. Nothing much to worry about. You just have to align yourself. You're setting yourself free from expectations from the past person. You're surrendering yourself and accepting what is true. And I feel like this new person is wanting you, your attention so strong, so badly. And you will be acknowledging that real soon. <clears throat> yeah end of tough cycle it's time for you to come out of your same space a comfortable space and discover your talents like maybe put into practice and we have your intuition is already guiding you towards your major life purpose I feel like there's something that you're waiting on a breakthrough. It will happen when you start to put all of your energy and attention towards yourself than someone else. And it's the hardest thing to do, I know. But that's your challenge. Wear a diamond and get a moonstone for yourself. Wait for the results. Within the next few weeks, you'll see this massive growth happening. <clears throat> in your love life, in your personal life, in your career. <clears throat> your angels are giving you messages through different means listen to them and get guided and we have cornucopia there's a lot of like you have a lot of opportunities doors opening up for you in terms of your career like you can grow a lot you can travel and i feel you will make a lot of impact in your work money is coming in appreciation is coming in so this is a lot more that you think that you you can achieve oh this is done anything else please for my aquarians there you go yes yeah, see you have a lot of opportunities in your career opening up which is going to take you towards major abundance i feel i'm also hearing that you might buy a house in a year like a huge house in a year or so, okay? <clears throat> okay, so now I will be picking up these signs. You might see a lot of force, which means that there is an opportunity coming in career. Like there is massive growth in your career about to take place, okay? You have Virgo coming in. You have Scorpio coming in. Check out my Scorpio channel for that. You have Capricorn coming in. I'm also seeing higher status coming in for you. So that is your read, Aquarius. I hope you've enjoyed this read. You may have gotten a major idea about what's going on in your life in general. This is... Um, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment. That's it. You know the drill. I'll see you again with more stuff. Bye-bye.